Hey everyone, I'm Ricky, and today I'm going to be making a quick video watching the season 3 trailer of 13 Reasons Why. So I've watched, I think, only the second season on this channel. A lot of people had mixed reactions to our, our, our reactions to it, um, the finale especially, and I just wanted to comment on that real quick before I get into this. A lot of people disliked it and commented saying like, this is what happens in real life, they had to show it, whatever. If you actually watched the end of the video, I, I mentioned that. I said, this is something that happens in real life. The reason why I cried is because it literally reminded me of something that ha happened that was almost exactly like that situation and it happened to a mentally disabled kid and uh, it's important for them to talk about it. What we were trying to convey was that there's a certain way to go about uh, talking about these things and showing these things without having to be so graphic and gratuitous about it. I feel like they kind of played that up for shock value. It didn't need to happen. <clears throat> it could have been implied. The way that they the way that they went about it, I think, wasn't handled in the cor correct way. But that's just my opinion. Everybody else has their own opinions. I'm excited for season three. Um, at the end of season two, like after the finale, like we all kind of felt just like sick and just kind of gross afterwards. Granted, that made an impact. Like season, two, the ending of season two made an impact, and it's something that got the conversation going. Again, I think it was in the wrong way, but it did its job in trying to start that conversation. But now season three is out, and I'm really excited because I'm going to be watching the trailer right now. So yeah. Let's just start. Okay. Oh, there's Tyler. Are they together? Okay. Just because it... Oh. What is that? Who is that? Who is that? Oh! <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <sighs> Bryce is dead! Oh my god, that's fucking awesome! Oh my god! We were talking about that in season 2, we were like, someone just needs to kill him and just like, get it over with, and somebody did! Oh my god, that's crazy! I can't believe they showed that in the trailer, but I guess like that's like the whole, it must happen in like the very first episode. Oh my god, that's crazy. And I love that, oh, that that's awesome because I feel like Bryce's, the actress that plays Bryce's mom is gonna get a lot of screen time now and, and like really show her acting chops because she played, um, I think Mary Alice in Desperate Housewives and she was so good in that. So I'm really, really excited for that, and I can't believe Bryce is dead, and I'm very excited, and it looked like Jessica and Alex are really just, like, going after people, and I'm, I'm happy about that. It looked like, it looked like, I think it was, like, Justin, Tyler, and Tony were all kind of in a group together. I don't know, maybe they're just, like, all helping each other out. I don't, I don't know. It looked like Alex had, like, a bruised eye. He must have gotten into a fight with somebody, which I'm not surprised because he doesn't give a shit. He'll fight anybody. But it looked like Jessica, like, had some new friends. Somebody pushed somebody else down. I think it was Mon Montgomery, but if... I, I'm not sure if it's gonna get out maybe that, like, what Montgomery did to Tyler. I'm not sure. I like, I like this whole, like, who killed Bryce Walker thing. That is a, a perfect way to go about the season because they kind of ended Hannah's whole story in the last season, but now they're going on with this continuation, which I think was perfect because it was it was basically like Bryce gets away with everything and now he gets to just move on with his life, but someone took revenge and got him. And it, it honestly, everybody has a motive to kill Bryce. Every single person. The most obvious suspects are going to be the ones that didn't do it. So like Tyler or Clay, Montgomery. I think, I, honestly, Montgomery could possibly do it because Bryce just kind of 
left him in the dirt. And then, like, right after that, Montgomery did what he did to um, Tyler. So, oh my god, that's crazy. And it looked like we had a new character that was, like, acting, like, real suspicious. I mean, obviously, she's probably not going to be the one to kill Bryce since it literally showed her... It looked like cleaning off blood uh, in the trailer. Unless that was... I don't... I don't know. There was one girl who... I it, it literally was, like, pointless in the story. She was Jessica's friend at one point, and then... For what reason, I don't know, to... She burned all of those pictures of the evidence of all the things that all the jock douches were doing to all these girls and, like, raping them. That was... That was bad. That was a bad part of the story. Like, it... It didn't make any sense. It just was to continue, like their shenanigans so that they wouldn't all just go to jail and have a happy ending like it, it was so just stupid it would have been better if maybe like one of the jock guys took it you know what i mean like then it, it would make more sense as to why they burned all the evidence like that's you know but yeah oh my god i'm so excited wait hold on when is this coming out august 23rd oh that's close oh my god i have so many shows that i have to watch I, okay so for this season of 13 reasons why i don't know if Rhea, Kayla, and Abby will be joining me and watching them um, only because I know they were affected by the shenanigans that go on. They're kind of over the show. They don't like the gratuitousness that happens and stuff and I get that. I understand the show's not for everybody but I had for like a split second thought that I'm like maybe wasn't going to continue on with the show. What happened in the ending of the last season was just like so beyond anything I want to just watch. It's just not something I want to watch and like Again, people are gonna comment, oh, it's not supposed to be, like, happy, blah, 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 but I just don't want to watch it. Like, it, I can know that it happens. Okay, great, that's enough for me. I don't have to be forced to watch it, but we'll see. I don't know. Wow. All right, so season three is coming up. I will be reacting to the whole season, I think, by myself. In the meantime, uh, watch my uh, Money Heist videos with me. We're watching Stranger Things right now on my channel. Uh, we're eventually going to be posting some Love, Death, and Robots. And also, I think I'm going to start with Orange is the New Black Season 7. The only problem with that is a lot of my past videos for Orange is the New Black have been taken down or copyright claimed by Lionsgate. And so I don't make any money off of those. They make all of the ad revenue money. Um, and it's always just a hassle. It keeps getting, like, all of my videos kept getting blocked and everything like that. It was just such a hassle dealing with Lionsgate with Orange is New Black videos. But if there's a way that I can find to just kind of get them to stop doing that, like, I will watch the whole season of that as well. But if by, like, the first episode I watch it and then it immediately gets taken down again, I'm, I'm not gonna watch that. So, but in the meantime, Stranger Things, Money Heist, I'm gonna be watching The Rest of You. I need to watch the finale of uh, the first season of Chilling Adventures of Sabrina. 13 Reasons Why will be coming up August 24th, and I'm gonna try to get the first episode out, like, almost immediately after it comes out. We'll see what happens with that. Let me know, like, your predictions about, like, who killed Bryce Walker, what you think's gonna happen this season, like, what in the trailer you think is gonna be significant, what do you think certain things mean. Um, I would love to hear all of your predictions. I can't wait. I'm I'm so excited that Bryce is dead. I can't wait. I wish I wish it was Montgomery that's dead, but like also it's cool that Bryce is dead too. Whatever. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Uh, I will see you when I start Thirteen Reasons Why season three. Bye.